Hi, we're at Rocky Mountain National Park and I want to point out the snow and the snow melt that you'll see on the ground down here. The reason that's so important is that snow melt is what feeds the river systems throughout the Colorado and I might add the entire Colorado River system. <laughs> And the reduction in runoff from snowpacks each year because of climate change has led to a shortage of water in many reservoirs such as Lake Mead uh, and others, Lake Powell. But the snowpack is part of the natural ecosystem here. So it's important to understand that while the snow is beautiful, it also helps provide natural water for wildlife, for trees, it helps with weathering and erosion of rocks, but it also helps people and it needs to be conserved. So thinking about this and recognizing that this is June like third or fourth, and this is what's left of the snowpacks, they're melting earlier and earlier each year. And that is causing less and less water to uh, end up in our reservoirs when there's the highest demand for it. It can also lead to flash flooding. So I might point out in this area right here that you can see some very large cobbles and that they're round. These rounded rocks are indicators of flash flooding. They've been tumbled in rivers over time. So that likely does happen uh, in this area even today. I also wanted to make a note, you can see some striations in the snow. And in glaciers, we can see those same striations occur, but they actually represent seasonal uh, deposition of the ice and any sediments or ash that's walked into them. So more to come. See you at the next stop. Bye.